gotta admit I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. I'm gonna try everything. Normal forms of interrogation weren't working. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. You've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training is complete. You just need to give the subject a name. Bell. She's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start cooperating. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. Plane leaves trap zone is stopping in Duva. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duva alive. We'll dump the bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of me. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. It was Park's idea to make you MI6. She wanted that bond with you. Even picked up a bit of her accent. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Adler's missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. Are your hands clean, Bell? Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. 
Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got Come a job. Come on, we've got a job. Come on. You've got a job to do. Got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. I fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you. It's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Queen of Earth, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovets. From the safety of Solovets. Solovets. This is your chance to find who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovets. Dugo. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Adler. Right. Yeah. Так точно. We'll leave within the hour. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine, the Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev, between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. Adler. Still seeing no activity from our side. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. place. We didn't see anything on our side either. It's her! You fucking lied to us! That true, Bell? You pull us out to the middle of nowhere Russia so Perseus can detonate those nukes?
it. Your friend went through here. He is not far. Come out and play. You are running out of time. And space. The cat becomes the mouse. You remember my face, don't you? Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold, but that chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. <laughs> As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. So amazing. Ah. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Hmm. Yet. For humanity. Their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done. Like nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials related to Operation Greenlight were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son of a bitch. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. We will watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire... A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced.